Bam. Okay, girl. Okay, girl. Yeah. <laughs> passar aí. Cachorro também. Tava tá com medo. Bicho muito louco ali. Nem vi. Ai, cansou de ficar sentada no. Ah! E o amigo? É um paredão. Não é possível. Ó, subiu. Cavalo, cavalo. Morreu. Caralho, mano. Ele vai sair da demais, né? É, moço. O cavalo tá loucaço. Bruninho corta caminho. O cavalo tá igual a gelatina. Cara, tá cheio dos ursos aqui, hein? Tá chovendo igual que hoje na cidade chuva também. Não é disponível devido às suas ações recentes. Nas imediações. O que, que eu fiz, cara? Ah não, velho. Esse jogo tá muito trollado, velho. Eu não fiz nada, eu só caí. Eu vou acampar aqui, vou dormir. Vou acampar na chuva. Vou dormir na chuva que esse jogo tá troll. Dormi. Ó, oh, posso até fazer viagem rápida, mano. Que história é essa? Mano, não sabia disso. Dormi pra ver se. É, vamos acordar de manhã. Se tiver frio, vou fechar a janela, tá? É igual você, ó, na sua casa. As garrafinhas na frente. Beleza. <risos> É, você não vai falar nada não. <risos> é, vamos ver se a missão liberou aqui. Foda. Cadê que tá perdido? Mano, a missão sumiu! Missão literalmente sumiu, velho. Quando o jogo quer trollar, ele trola daquele. Aquela maneira. Eu entro na onda de rastreamento de mal lendário. Caça de mal lendário. 
animal lendário. Mano. Nem lembro como é que faz. Né? Lembra do cabelo do meu personagem? Quem tava aqui, peraí, vem. Daqui a pouco você vai ver. Você. Um negócio aqui. O animal lendário fez isso aqui. Olha aí, animal lendário. Não vai dar merda. Eu nem tô com arma. Mano. Ele tava barbudão Mas agora ele não tá tanto assim Deixar a carne aqui. É, meu cavalinho vai morrer se o bicho chegar aqui. Lei, velho, animal lendário vai aparecer aí. Não sei o que quer, não. Isso aqui eu vou morrer, tá chegando. Vou me esconder. O cavalo tá lá, vai devorar o cavalo. Sai daí, cavalo. Ah, mano, eu vou deixar de lado, na moral. Vambora, cavalo, falhou. Hoje é o dia, mano. Hoje é o dia. E a missão que isso. Ah, é um alce louco. Nem sei como é que faz pra pegar ele, não, mas tudo bem. Nunca cai de cavalo, agora toda hora. Morte eu não bati. Isso foi suposto ser nossa pequena aventura. Ah, você está bem lá? Quem é você? Bom, está tudo bem, mas eu não quero dizer que você sabe. Bem, não faz nenhuma diferença agora. Se um animal ou um animal não me dá starvation. We came out here from the city in search of a different life. A cabelinho do pai. Something true, something real. Ele tava todo barbudão, cabelão. Deixa o bigode de estar fixo. All this squandering and indulgence, we wanted to strip it away to find something authentic. What a pair of fools! Train station or a town I can take you to. No, I can't give up now. He wouldn't want that. 
I can't have it. I'm gonna do this for you. First thing about hunting, couldn't even catch a darn mouse. If you need any poisonous berries, though, I'm a natural at finding those. Well, you ain't gonna last much longer out here if you don't know how to hunt. Come on, I'll show you. Vou ensinar a viúva a caçar. Mas você não vai tentar fazer nada de engraçado. Eu posso ser fraco, mas eu ainda sei como se defender. Oh, eu não tenho dúvida. Vamos lá. Vamos lá. Você já se esqueceu um animal antes? Não, mas, de novo, eu não tenho caçado. Achei que era aqui, falei, uai, tem alguém conversando comigo, pô, como? Eu ia pôr o next dream back to Chicago, se eu disse a palavra. Mas agora, eu não sei, é difícil de explicar. Eu tenho que fazer isso. Eu entendo. Sim, é um bom lugar. O que estamos procurando? Bem, eu acho que devemos começar com algo pequeno, não é? Eu matei ele, você matou ele, não é verdade? Coelhinho na cabeça. Mata ele. Ele não viu. Olha ela que vai escolar. Ensina ele a escolar. Ó. Ó. É na mão? Eita porra! Vai não, não quero nem ver. Não, mas aqui eu sei que não é de verdade, né? Pô, deixa eu ver. Mas eu não vou ver nem pagando. Falar alto, né? Você tá profissional, foi só na, na mãozada. I get the impression they did more hunting than hunting. Right. Hey, 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 lobo, porra. No, we're done for now. Wolf, stay back. Just a smell of dead rabbit. I think. Oh no, I should. Go pick up. Yeah, there's a lobo for you to get too. Vou esfolar o lobo, ó. Vamos ver como é que esfola. Olha lá, tem faquinha. Meu 
Abriu. Ele de lobo ruim não, vou largar. Ah, é porque eu fiquei com a arma. Não vergonha de falar, ninguém vê não, ninguém vai ver não, é madruga. Uma mulher de um dedo, né? Tô baixo o Thank you. That was the first time anyone's done anything nice for us. For me, since we got here. Cada manhã tá vermelho com preta. Canibal. I'd invite you in, but I'm dead on my feet. If you'll forgive the pun. Please do call again sometime, though. A good rest, and hopefully I'll be a new woman. Take care, man. Depois que eu digo mil outra tá merda. Não, cara, tu Fácil, é só fazer a primeira peça. E viajar. Facilita a minha vida, mas... Guarda a... <risos> Passa logo agora, trem.
dropped in. I've got that, uh, information you asked for. Um, I need something more specific this time. A wagon full of moonshine. Well, you might just be in luck. I knew I picked the right feather to speak to. How do you do? Tava lendo a legenda, espero que eu vi pra cá. Pegar pra site. No, what? I do beg your pardon. Hey, mister, you need a ride Can somewhere? I get a ride, please, partner. So, where are you going? Stand to knee, please. Won't take no time at all to get there. <laughs> Já acabou? Nada. Testa o outro mouse ali depois, ó. E? E? Falando testar, talvez o outro ali tá. Tá com direito, vou levar isso. Mano, tu vai matar meu cavalo, filho da mãe. Olha isso. Caralho, tio. Meu amigo. Meu Deus, véio, o cara tá trollando meu cavalo. Vou matar esse cara. Meu cavalo tá preso? O que eu faço? Ei, tá doido, cara. Vou ligar, mano. Com vontade de atirar no cara disso. Cavalinho. show if that's possible what's this show then mr charles chatternay go and see for yourself but don't blame me i just don't like how much time you're spending with the man is all just wait until you see his work it's very progressive well i'm not so very sure how i feel about progression paintings or otherwise come on you won't have seen the like of it before I, I reckon the back of your head screen. might be your best feature. 
Meu Deus, o que eu tô procurando? Um livro. Ali ele. Bottom modern for my taste. Look at these idiots. Tem ninguém no quadro dele, sacanagem. Excuse me, Mr. Chatterney. Couldn't you have painted some drawers on her? Madame, I paint her in her natural state, as she was and will be in paradise. There's nothing natural about that. Clothes are civilization, repression, death. To be naked is to be free, innocent, alive. Like Buddha said, you know, we are all just here to fuck. <gasps> Well, that explains the decadence of those Hottentots. Hey, you got a picture of my wife here. In her... delicate! <gasps> Henry, oh. is that your behind? Did <laughs> oh, <what, what>, <laughs> you show it to that man? Ela achou ela ali. As nude as the day she was born! Stop looking at my husband's buttocks! Oh, well. hmm? Stop looking at my mama! Well, maybe <laughs> she shouldn't expose herself like that! This is disgusting! A nerve on you! That's it! <laughs> oh, come on, Mildred! This is no place for us! Come here! Hey. I am a bitch! Oh, you God. filthy little man! Oh. Oh. Come on, horse! We'll leave it! Hey, I'm coming after you, Frenchie! Hey! All right! Mano, eu defendi! Ah, tá apertando de atar. Hoje é o dia. Tá cansou de soldar? Cara, vinte e nove. Fica aqui, ó. Caralho, tá com a Aqui no notebook. Né? Tá sem som, né? Coloca o som aí no notebook. Tá três aí. Easy, easy. 
Olha a carroça vindo. É bonito. Passarei voando. Jacaré ali. Who we got here? Tomara que esses dois caras não estejam fazendo falta. Vou roubar, mano. Não! Ah, mano. Eu não fiz isso. Pra olhar a morte. Ah, mano. Bacalhou até o olho da mão. Véi, que cagada que eu fiz. É fácil ele matar os quatro. Caralho, o tiro de 12 matou do Kiff. Eu vacilei muito nessa. Né? Vacilo. So, I got you, Moon. You're a wonderful oh, man. Just talking to another one. You got my money? Uh, it's, it's for a very good cause. Uh, my name is Professor Andrew Bell the Third. Perhaps you've heard of me. <laughs> Can't say that I have. Oh, I'm an inventor. Uh, maybe you've read about me. <laughs> uh, I don't read much. Oh, oh, well, that's too bad. Oh, yes. <laughs> you got my money? <clears throat> oh, well, it, it is the most wonderful invention, friend. Oh, you, sir, have done a great All deed. All I've done is get some creep a lot of drink. <laughs> creep is excellent. No nonsense. Now, you've helped me develop the most humane machine imaginable, a way to induce calmness to our most troubled souls, a way to end the barbarity of a public hanging. Oh, so, so humane. What are you talking about? The electric chair. What? See, it's a chair full of electricity. It's quite fascinating. It calmly and peacefully dispatches the sinners uh, to face judgment. Yes, judgment. Yeah. Where mm. is it? Well, uh, it's in my laboratory. The next thing I need is a, a demonstration, a public one. Huh. 
Uh, do you know the police chief? Hmm? As well as anyone. Oh, wonderful! Perhaps you can encourage him to let me demonstrate the chair. It will help bring this town into the next century. Yes, could you do that? Hmm? <laughs> Mas esse CD é tão ruim de ficar. Fazendo da vida. So welcome to our humble police house. Only thing good about jail is the food. I can't Chief, possibly help you. I represent you. You the inventor of a humane execution machine, an electric chair, and he uh wants to demonstrate his invention here. Ah, I'm familiar with the man and his work. Tell you what. I'll give you a permit, but it's going to cost you $100 in fees. Hey, look, this will save you money in the long run, and uh, it'll save the condemned a whole lot of pain. That yeah, remains to God, be seen. But I'll give you a permit for $50. I do. Okay, well, the price is fair. Here you go. And here think this is, uh, is your permit. Appending the usual formalities, of course, such as uh, finding a suitable candidate for humane dispatchment. I'll tell that to the professor. Good luck. Good evening, mister. Alright, I'm going to go Oh no. Yeah. Uh. Even Mr. Music is that. Ah, hello, friend. Hello, Professor. Professor Andrew Bell the Third. That's it. So, the chief says you can test out your machine, oh. pending the usual formalities. And what are they? Well, finding a suitable uh, subject. Ah, funny you should mention. This fella here. 
sure he seems sturdy enough and he's guilty as sin. Wilson J. McDaniels, wanted for murder, bigamy, and immoral animal husbandry. What's that? The mind shudders. Here, find him for me and help me put him out of his misery. Come on, my dear. O olho do meu personagem yes. tá vermelho, mano. Ah, uh, I'm, uh, uh, sorry. I'm looking for, um, the mayor. Yes, please, uh, Mr. Kilgore, or what was it? Um, I forget. Quite. Welcome to government. Democracy. An interesting idea. Monsieur Lemieux? Oh, hello, friend. Hello. Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, really? Okay. Now, you are not going to rob me again, are you? No, I... I'm sorry. Uh... <laughs> Don't worry about it. But you are not a very popular man. There's all kinds of nasty people want to speak to you, Mr. Tacitus. I know. They won't hear anything about you from me. But? Uh, yeah, there's always a but. Of course, I'm a politician. Who needs killing? Nobody. We are not savages, merely Frenchmen. Don't be ridiculous, killing. Oh, dear. Terrifying, yes. I suppose I can do that almost as well as kill. I'm sure you well, can. Now, it's all very ethical. You see, I've been trying to open a major museum, a place of culture to elevate people's souls. And what do museums need? Uh, art! <laughs> and how do you buy art? I buy art of some nasty little men from Paris selling me some destitute aristocrat's collection of old masters that it turns out he may have been painting himself. Ouch. Ouch but these are good paintings. I can't make the difference, and I'm French. Only this even nastier little man from New Haven has come here to verify my point. Hey, He's man. saying that they're all fake. So? So perhaps he can be persuaded to revise his opinion. Oh, he's been so beastly. Exactly. Now, Jean-Marc, perhaps you can take Mr. Arthur, oh, I mean Mr. Tacitus, to meet a little Professor Shitface and have a word with him. Saint-Denis welcomes you like a son, sir. 
Bonne chance. Come, sir, if you don't mind. The gallery is just at the end of this avenue. As I said, he is a beastly man, this professor. Believe me, friend, he ain't seen beastly yet. And close. That's what you know. I thought we French had a monopoly on air guns, but no. An overeducated American can be far, far worse. Well, luckily, there ain't too many overeducated Americans around. Yes, indeed. The mayor had such grand plans for our city and its people. We shall have truly broad democracy. Working for the rich and the poor alike. You are quite the carriage driver. It would be a travesty for this one man's opinion. <laughs> That the gallery is just up ahead. There, Mr. Arthur, there! No. What's his name again? Professor Shiftaker. Oh, silly. Oh. I put him car armed for coffee. Agora. Professor? Excuse me. Ah. Oh. Oh. Hello. The mayor asked me to get a preview of your findings in there. The mayor knows very well what I found. Every painting was a brazen fraud. <laughs> That's a big claim. One that's gonna upset a lot of people, myself included. I'm afraid that's just hard cheese. Now I've got a train to catch back to New Haven. Hold on. I see it's gonna take a fist in your face to persuade you. Oh, oh, wait, wait. Now. I, I'd never be published again! <coughs> no, no! Uh, I relent! I relent! <laughs> there! You see, Professor? An academic reputation is really far less important than a broken note. Yes, sir. I, 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 I see that now. The thing is, now people are going to look at those paintings and love them. So you're helping people, really. I, I, you know I'm right, Professor. Please not get me upset with you no, again. No, 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 sir. You're right. You're very, very right. So you're going to send the mayor what he needs. Um... Because otherwise, I'll be in New Haven. No, no. We don't want that. Of course uh, we I'll don't. I'll write my paper this evening, sir. Very good, Professor. Very good. So, Oops. turns out, all those paintings huh? were real after all. <sighs> Problem solved. Wonderful, wonderful. The mayor back. shall be so pleased. Sure. Was uh, Professor Shiftaker happy to change his mind? He wasn't initially, but uh, he came around in the end. Huh? Oh, my lord. Huh? This is not right. Trust me, I've done much worse. We shall burn in hell. No, fight. no fight this. Yeah. The mayor asked me to give you this. Oh, thank you. Não, solta de... Se liga o computador. Vou desligar aqui, ok? Good morning to you.
save. Vou desligar. Tem mais um. Bom. Tá bom. Ah, parece que não tá vindo. As trancinhas que eu fiz. Ah. Solzinho. Intensidade assim que as faz, tipo, réplica das de verdade. Caralho, velho, tá ali. Deve ter uma fase, vamos ver se vai dar. Deve ter uns 3 segundos de água. Ai, filha da mãe, olha o jacaré. Olha o jacaré. Ei, quietinho. The thing is, Sadie, I really can't. I must oh? come, he's my husband. I know he's your husband, but it's gonna be. I insist. Insist all you like. Aqui. Ain't happening. Arthur Taylor. Abigail, you ain't coming, that's the end of the matter. See, there you heard him. Now let's go. But, but nothing mais, will be quicker and easier with just the two of us. Plus, John will be calmer without worrying about you. Ain't complicated. Well, why ain't the crime sore? I'm real grateful. Yeah, we know you are. We'll bring him back to you. Hmm? No, no, that Thank you. Thank you both. Não, você pode ver pela tela do Rambalho. Here goes nothing. The place is surrounded by marshland. Should hopefully give us a bit of cover to move in close enough to find a spot and look for John. This time of day, prisoners probably work in the field. Then all we gotta do is take out all the guards and run away out of there. Seems simple enough. How many times, Marshland? Não dá pra escutar. Fala baixo aqui. Ok, bring us over. Oh, bicho. Oh, we good? Uh -huh. Let's head for that watchtower. Ok. Stay low. Não entra nada. 
Ah, okay. Derramou o frente. Voltei no meu pescoço, ó. Caralho. Grab that raffle. You can use the scope. Uma snipezinha, já era. Hey, I think I see him. There's a group in front of that barn, just to our right. Ah, yeah. I see two guards. Okay, take them out and let's go get our boy. Okay. Let's go over there and see. Okay, come on. I think one of those guards was still moving. Tô tocando alarme. Essa mulher. Brabo. Arthur, let's keep moving. Where is he? You see him? No. You, Miss. They took my phone, too, man. You know John Marsden? This. I, he ain't. He ain't working today. Is she? Put the gun down, lady. No. You put the gun down. Now. That's it, man. Where's John Marston? Uh, he ain't in the work detail today. Okay, well, I guess we'll go and get him together. Try anything and I'll blow your damn head off. You clear on that? Yes, very clear. Oh, no, you don't. Come on, partner. <laughs> You apologize to the lady for pointing a gun at her. Excuse me? I said apologize. <laughs> I'm sorry, ma'am. Ain't no harm done. So, where do we go? Towards the entrance, I guess. And who's in charge of this fine establishment? Not what it was. Jameson, sir. Jameson who? No, Mr. Jameson. Heston Jameson. Uh, is he a nice fellow? Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, God, uh. He's been quite an exacting boss at times. I look forward to meeting him. They're... They're not gonna let you do this. Well, that's gonna be up to you, my friend. So, you a popular employee, my friend? Not especially. Well, I guess we're about to find out. Come on, march him straight up to the front gate. We better hope someone in there actually gives a damn about this fool. Guess we'll see. We're gonna have to shoot our way out of here regardless. Uf. É base, cheio de cara ali. É pra nem ir apontar. Ok, friend, be cool now. Just do as I say. Drop the goddamn guns! Deixa os caras largar, né? 
Jameson! Is Jameson in? He's in San Denis. They got Milliken. Got him and gonna kill him. Unless you bring me John Marston. Right now. You got one minute. I'm counting. One, two, three. Milliken, is it? Yes, sir. Will you count for me? I got talking to do. Uh, yes, sir. Of course, sir. <clears throat> From one or four? Oh, sir? very funny. Now, we must be at 11 by now. 11, 12, 13, faster. 14, 15, 16, 17. Now, hurry up. <laughs> well, this poor fool's got to get his brain shot out. And over what? For nothing. Uh, Milliken, don't stop counting. I can't hear you. Hurry up and bring that asshole out here, you bastards. Come on. <laughs> don't cry, buddy. I don't want to die. Yeah, I know, I know. Hey, hey, John, love you too. Now, no funny business. Well, Mr. Milliken here will stop crying once and for all. Okay, today's your lucky day. Let's go! I see. Here comes some more. Get down. Been a while, John. You're telling me. What took you so long? I'll explain later. Thank you. Blue? Yeah. Believe me, that was my one and only time flying. Olha esse tiro, velho. I see. Esse cara que morrendo pra manter na... Nossa, onde que voltou, velho? Tá brincando comigo, onde que voltou?
Aí, eu vou tomar tiro nas costas agora. Arthur Tá me gritando igual louco, eu tô tomando tiro Aí Tô no tanto de tiro Olha lá Não tive nem reação mano. Não tive reação, sério Eu já não ia tomar um tiro que é calambi hoje Eu tomo outro Ah não tá, Vou usar o da morte Que barulho essa porra Pegou no ferro, velho. Vai desviou. Olha lá. Não faz pega no dois. É, manda correr. Toma Eu não vi feliz esconder. Esconde, filho. Bastante cara. Mão, né? Olha com a mão dela. Deu morrendo. Agora eu vou correr depois desse aqui e você vai ver o que vai acontecer. Será que eu não enxergo? Não pegou nenhum! Ah, eu morri. Agora que... Ah, 
Mano, tem que correr mesmo. O que que tá rindo? Nice to see you, Arthur. Ah, uh, there's some fellas coming here don't look too friendly. We best get out of here. Come on, boys, let's move. I'll roll. Viu, pai, you you Let me. Oh, tem mais. Que treta da treta da treta da treta. You know, I think I liked you better when you was all dressed up like a prize chicken. No doubt. Oh, hurry up. They're gonna be on our tail soon enough if you boys keep wasting time. Oh, that's us told them. <sighs> Hey, Arthur. Thank you. Don't mention it. Let's go. We should get out of here quick before the law gets wind of this. So what the hell happened in San Denis? Is Abigail all right? She's fine. Jack is too. She managed to escape when they got Hosea. Hosea? That still don't seem real somehow. All them years. Arthur, he was like, like family. Yeah, we lost young Lenny too. No, what a goddamn mess. And did we, what about the, the money? Lost somewhere at the bottom of the ocean. What, how the hell did that happen? We hit on a boat, the only way out of there. The boat went down in a storm, and we ended up stranded on an island somewhere near Cuba. Cuba? Wait, you're gonna have to tell me all this again. It's a long story, but things ain't been good, John. <laughs> you're telling me? We're holed up now in the mountains to the north, near Rono Grids, and some caves there. The Pinkertons caught up with us again, and we had to move. Yeah, seems Molly ratted us out, the bitch. So she's dead too. Jesus, maybe you should have just left me to hang. And uh, I should warn you, Dutch didn't want us breaking you out. Said it wasn't the right time, so <laughs> might not be the hero's welcome you're imagining. So much for no man left behind. I can't stop thinking about this. In the bank, when they grabbed me, he saw it. Felt almost like he had a, a moment to do something and didn't. The Dutch ain't himself right now. Or maybe he just ain't who we thought he was. Guess we don't need to worry about who's his favorite no more. Huh. Guess not. We told you we would. John! What are you doing here? It's good to see you too, partner. I meant I hadn't sent for you yet. I went. But I said that. Yeah, I know what you said. I felt different. Is that so? Yes. And? When Spring and John brings the law down on all of us, what then, Arthur? Well, I guess we'll have another fight on our hands. Loyalty, Arthur, it ain't. I had a goddamn plan! John. John. 
You are my brother. You are my son. I was coming for you. They... They was talking of hanging me, Dutch. They was talking. They was talking. And now they may come and hang us all. Hey, it's just that's the big loss. Oh, sorry. I was miles away, thinking of, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Dutch said to tell you he and Mike have gone to Annisburg. Something about Mr. Cornwall. Cornwall. Okay. Thanks, Mary Beth. Oh, my. Not Bill. Um cowboy aqui, olha lá. Eita por si. Falou, pessoal.